Hello! Welcome to News Vortex! Work continues at the Belikova Fluorite, Barite and Rare Earth Elements Enterprise of the General Directorate of ETI Mining Enterprises Belikova, affiliated to the Ministry of Energy and Natural Resources, which ranks second in the world with 694 million tons of rare earth element reserves after the Bayan Obio field in China which has 800 million tons of reserves. Business manager Lutfi Tozer said, countries, especially China and the USA, are struggling hard for the production of these mines. We are in an advantageous situation because we have such a large field and reserve in our country. In the operation, which has a total mining area of 17,600 acres, 125,000 meters of drilling was carried out in 310 locations in 2011 to 2017, 60,000 samples were taken and a reserve figure of 694 million tons was reached. In the project, which is closely followed by the Minister of Energy and Natural Resources Fadi Donmez, the installation works of the pilot plant, where 1,200 tons of ore will be processed annually, have been completed. In the plant, 600 tons of rare earth element ore was also extracted and made ready for processing. The facility was opened by President Recep Tayyip Erdogan today. Belikova Fluorite, Barite and Rare Earth Elements business manager Lutfi Tozer told AA correspondent that Belikova is the second largest field in the world with 694 million tons of rare earth elements reserves after the Bayan Obio field in China. Explaining that they reached a reserve of 694 million tons as a result of their studies in the field between 2011 to 2017, Tozer said. The assembly works of the pilot plant where the ore will be processed have been completed. Approximately 600 tons of ore that we will use in the pilot plant is ready in the field. It has been mined. Our pilot plant has an annual processing capacity of 1,200 tons of ore. We have fluorite, barite, rare earth elements, mainly lanthanum, cerium, praseodymium, samarium, gadolinium, europium, and neodymium in our ore. These are at producible levels. In addition, the other 17 rare earth elements are also available in certain proportions. Thorium will also be processed in this facility. The elements that we will obtain by processing the ore in this facility are materials used in high-tech products, green energy transformation, defense industry, laser, guidance systems and all kinds of electronics, the most important feature of which is that they have no substitutes. Stating that the mines in question are of strategic importance, Tozer said. Countries, especially China and the USA, are struggling hard for the production of these mines. We are in an advantageous situation due to the fact that such a large field and reserve is in our country. So what do you think about this topic? Don't forget to leave your thoughts in the comments and like the video. Thank you for watching us and we wish you healthy and safe days. See you in the next video.